Hello, everyone. So it was a bit of a tease today with the exercise not working, but I got the web page up now. So let's look real quickly at what I wanted us to do. So we did talk about how audio is sampled. What it means is, is the audio travels through the air, as this slinky shows in the video I sent you. And when the air particles um, near the microphone move back and forth, they actually move this fiber on the microphone back and forth, and we measure or sample that many, many times per second. So 44,100 times per second is pretty typical for how we measure. So for example, if I say, if I'm sitting here and my laptop microphone is here and I say, hello world, well then that looks like this. Here's the hello and here's the world. And actually that was almost, with the silence there, it was almost three seconds of audio. So that's certainly going to be more than 100,000 elements in the array. So this is not something you would want to look at in a debugger. Usually we plot it like this. Hello world. Okay, so just to show you that I, I successfully recorded. Now the exercise that we were supposed to do in class was, okay, watch this. Now if I play this reversed. Or, well, sounds pretty weird. What if I try to match that sound, the reverse sound? So let me play it again. Or, well, okay, let me try it. Sorrel, Ella. Oops, I didn't record. Let me try it again. Sorrel, Ella. Sorrel, Ella. Let's see if I got it. So if I reverse it again, it should sound like Hello World. Hello. hello. <laughs> so I totally botched the world, but I got the hello. So, but that's the game I, I wanted us to try. So maybe some of you can try that and, and post a result on Discord. I added these buttons so that you can download the audio that you generate. And I would love it if you could share some of that. So, but that, that's it. And now we'll move on to some Python.